Hi guys, so this is a scripted video. I actually wrote a script for once so I don't get off too off topic and it's gonna be a very hard one for me to make. Before taping out any angry comments, please watch the whole video. Um, hear me out guys. I've been thinking on this for quite a while. So my experience on YouTube has been amazing. Since the beginning, my channel has been just like my hobby, something for me to post what I want and have fun, and while doing that I've met some amazing people and had some amazing experiences. My channel's growth these last two years has honestly been a dream. You guys make me smile so much with your comments and all your excitement. I do read all my comments, honestly, it's just, it, it's amazing. I don't think the way I currently run my channel will be able to work in the future, though, unfortunately. Um, I'm currently a senior in high school, which, I mean, if you're not familiar with American school terms, that means I'm on my final year of high school. I'm going to be graduating this year, in June. And uh, if these last few months I've been thinking about my future a lot, and... That includes the future of my channel because it's really a big part of my life, um, outside of the rest of my life at least. Um, I have no plans to stop making content for YouTube. I love making my videos and honestly I can't imagine my life without it. I'm not sure how college will go. I'm the oldest of my siblings and I'm going to attend an art college which, as some of you may know, has a lot of, like, work. It's a lot of work to keep up with, a lot of deadlines, and scary. It's it's a scary thought, but I'm excited. I have no idea what to expect. What I do know is that I'll have to share a dorm with three or four people. I'll also have significantly less time to make videos because of the work. I don't know where I will be able to record my voice in this dorm. I honestly don't think I will be getting much time alone, which is an introvert's worst nightmare. I'm just hoping I can make friends. It's good. And yeah, with working, school, all that, I have to work to support myself, to pay for college and all that. It's, it's just... I'm scared to think what's going to happen to my channel and how I'll be able to do it. But I still plan on doing it. Uh, I think you guys know where this is going. Uh, especially if you've read the title, you already knew where this was going from the start. I think I need to end basically Wings of Fire. As it is currently, at least. <sighs> this is a really hard decision for me that will upset many people. But I've been thinking about it for a while. I, I wouldn't just end it like this on you guys. You guys enjoy it. I enjoy making it. Um, you know. Before you comment, I do plan to restart the series. So it's not going to just straight up disappear. It's going to be in a slightly different format though. And right now I'm just trying to figure out the best way to go about that. The new way to, I'm going to show basically like the art i'm gonna have to redo all my art maybe maybe i'll keep the old ones um if you can remember i posted a video with my future plans for basically wings fire uh, a few months ago i think it was maybe it was it was probably about half a year ago now maybe longer um i wanted to start posting by the book rather than the chapter and that's been my plan for a while and that's how this new format is going to go. I want it, I want to do it with Wings of Fire along with other books I enjoy, Magisterium, Percy Jackson, Heroes of Olympus, a whole bunch of books um that I can make these videos of. Um before I started this, I wanted to finish the Dragonette Prophecy. Um but now I'm starting to think it would be best just to start a new and like completely restart Dragonet Prophecy in this new format, have it be its own book, and continue from there, along with books that aren't on Wings of Fire. Um, 
this will allow me to get through more books, have, I hope, more content, because they will be shorter than, obviously, what it would be if I went each episode as a chapter like it currently is. So maybe we'll actually get to finish the series. <laughs> Who knows? Um, I think it would be best to build up some of these before college, but right now, yeah, like I mentioned before, it's just figuring out the format. Sorry, I'm getting off script a little bit. <laughs> While trying to write the first script for this new format, I've discovered it's really hard to continue doing it in the exact style that I've been current, like, I've been previously making the episodes. Um... I've already been compared to Moon Kitty quite a bit, which is a bit of an honor and a curse at the same time. I would li- It would be a lie if I said I've never seen her content before, but she definitely didn't inspire basically Wings of Fire. Uh, I could honestly make a whole video on that itself, what inspired basically Wings of Fire, because it's kind of a lot. More than you'd expect. <laughs> The summary style, I feel, would make my content a bit too close to hers, um, is what I'm trying to say. Other people make content similar, but usually it's for TV, movies, games, and uh, one of my favorite uh, summary style videos is of uh, myths from around the world. I love them. So, like, it's it's more common than just Moon Kitty, but... I haven't seen someone else do it with books, and I don't want people to think of me as a copycat, or that I'm... I don't know. If... I just want to hear what you guys think about this. Would it annoy you? Would you stop watching my videos? I personally believe it's the best way for me to go, but I don't want to do it if it's gonna upset people, or people are gonna have problems with it. At that point, I might just have to drop... Basically, because I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it the same way with the voice acting. or I mean, the characters doing their own lines and stuff like that. I don't know how I'm going to write the new style of script because I've been going about this old way for so long, too. But I just, I just want to give it a shot. Uh, now that the elephant is out of the room, I, I also need easy video ideas that I can do in college. I don't think I'll be able to join many maps, and basically will still be my biggest project, so I just want smaller things that I can post more frequently. I'll still be doing speed paints of pictures I make. That's kind of a given. It's not really something I have to do extra for, because usually I'm already making the art and the speed paints just a bonus. Um, I, um, could also possibly share what I'm doing in college, but I'm not sure if you guys would be interested in that or what it would really entail. I'm, I don't know, it's, it would probably be me sharing my projects, what I'm working on, uh, maybe some college life stuff with friends. Maybe I'll get another friend to guess basically Wings of, or guess Wings of Fire characters, who knows. Um... Book reviews are still a possibility. I haven't been able to read much as it is in high school, so in college, I don't know, especially if I have to reread all these books to write scripts for, basically. Who knows, but I think they could still be fun, especially if it's like a new book that comes out. Um, I've been thinking story time videos might be fun tr- to try out. Probably not full-on, like, PMV animation tweening style stories, but maybe one of the ones that kind of goes along with a speed paint would be fun. Uh, I love any ideas and suggestions you will throw my way. I appreciate all of that, and I do take everything into consideration. Um, if you've made it this far, you're a true fan, and I love you. Let me know if, what you think of my plans for Basically and other content. Uh, Thank you guys for being so understanding while I figure out everything. It's, it's just, it's overwhelming and it just needs to happen before 
I end up in a spot where I just kind of disappear because I'm in college and I'd never figured this stuff out. Thanks again, guys. I I love you.